Welcome back, Phillies and General Colts, to a brand new place Minecraft. You know, one of these days I might up the frame rate from 30. Just maybe. Just maybe. So, we're not doing much at the moment. Just letting things grow and um, stuff like that. Ooh, that grew pretty quickly. Make it, we want to just make more coal until we can get, or yeah, make more charcoal into coal until we can finally get our last little, our last little bastion, our diamond. It's the last thing that's holding out. I don't know why I said our last bastion. It's not a last bastion at all. Oops, that's the rubber tree. Sorry, rubber tree. Actually, the best thing is that oh, these other trees have given the rubber trees back some of their leaves. It's awesome. Um, what was I talking about? I don't know. It's a new episode. I don't know. I make these like five hours apart. How would I know? Just kidding. I make these usually right after another for a couple days. Uh, I know what I need. I want another iron furnace because this one is slow. But the stone matches her, and it's it's so traditional. But it's slow and inefficient. It is slow and inefficient. So let us not spend more time than we need on that. But we are going to need to get um, iron. Five iron. So let's see. How many iron is four? There we go. Five iron. And we we'll make a furnace. There we go, an iron furnace. And I haven't made a pick yet, so this could be a little while, or we could just real quick make one. Do, 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 do. Won't take long. Got me a pick, I'm singing my song. Oh yeah. Gonna pick this up. Put this down. There we go. La da da da. There we go. We've upgraded. Now I feel like I've been productive this episode. And oh, why do we have an extra furnace? Did I Oh, because I just picked it up. Herba dooba doop. I feel like I should now make that into an iron furnace as well, but I'm probably just going to turn it into EMC. Oh, it's EMC is 8. It's hard to turn that into EMC, into something useful. Maybe I can turn it into, like, a shovel. Turn my furnace into a shovel. Sword is 6. Oh, because... So it would take... Oh, so a shovel is going to be more than... A shovel is going to be, like, 9. Maybe if I toss in a piece of dirt. There we go. <laughs> Furnace plus dirt gives a shovel. Sure. I'll go with that. A lot of trees growing real quick. Looks like some squares are just natural. Excuse me, naturally quick, 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 quack, quack, quack. Some squares are naturally quick quack growers. Lots of quick quack here. Uh, we're running into the same problem that we did before, and that is that we're actually. The trees grow so much faster than leaves can decay. So a lot of these leaves don't decay. They just like over here, this tree leaf, you know, a bunch of these leaves aren't gonna decay anymore because this tree just grew and over there, now a bunch of them won't decay. Now there is a limit, sure, there's like a six block limit. But you know, that doesn't always mean anything. On the other hand, it keeps us busy, and it makes sure that we've always got EMC coming. Uh, and that's that's really what we need. We need a constant supply, a fresh constant supply of EMC. That's what's important to good Skyblock series. That is a rule that I just made up, but seems to have some correctness to. All right. Luckily, trees give off so many saplings that even without all the leaves decaying, we should be fine. The only thing I have to worry about is if there's another giant tree, and uh, when it, you know, when we cut down the giant tree, they leave logs way up in the air. So that could be tricky. Getting all those logs down. 
Really, it just means cutting down a bunch of these things. Oh, this is Tekken, right? Did we have Balkan's weapons? Oh, I wonder... Inficraft had a machete that could cut down leaves really quick. Do we have a machete? We have a stone spear. If there is something like this, it's not made of stone. Hmm. A stone sword. Let's check the recipe guide. There's no machete. No. Hmm. And we look at the iron weapons. We have iron shovel, pickaxe, axe, sword, hoe, spear, warhammer, battle axe, flail, halberd, and knife. But no machete. So I guess if we want... Oh, and a handsaw, of course. Oh, hey, look. Copper to iron upgrades. Ooh. And refined iron dust. Let's take a look. Copper... Oh. It's one of those. We can't look at it, can we? Ah. Shucks. Some recipes just don't work very well. Oop. That's not what I wanted. There we go. That's okay. Let's cut down some more wood. Got wood. Oh my. So George Decay, totally awesome guy on Facebook and in general. Hilarious. Sort of funny. Haha. -ha. Funny. Stuff like that. You know, if you like laughing. Do you like laughing? I don't know. Do you like laughing? Maybe you don't. Maybe you're some sort of weird anti laughing communist or something. I don't mean to offend any actual communists or socialists out there. I think that's a fine ideal so long as you're not Putin. It seems like a good thing to, you know, just don't be Putin, kids. It's like catching on fire. Just, just don't catch on fire. Okay, shouldn't be too hard. Don't be Putin. Oh, we're out of stuff, so let's go ahead and take, let's say half of that put in there as long term. And we can put half of that in here. It's roughly equivalent. Let's go ahead and make stuff. 18 coal. We can macerate that up. Oh, we're getting, we're getting there. We might not need that much more. Oops. Our power levels in the bat box are looking okay, but we'll want to put a little bit more charcoal in soon. Let's see how much we have. We've got one coal dust sitting there ready to go. We have enough flint. So remember, we've got three in the chest already. So there's one, two, three. Okay, so we have three here. We have six in the chest, one more there, which means that as soon as we get enough right there, we'll be good. And I can stop using the word there, over there, around there, all the time, because there, there is really um, upsetting you. And they think you should stop using their word, which they made up. It was a very nice third person. Oh gosh. It's a very nice third person word for the third person plural. See, if a tree goes right now, it's dangerous to be out here. I've been hit by trees before. I've been almost hit by trees more than I've been hit by trees, but you gotta be careful. It's crazy. These trees, they don't know when to give up, man. And, and they're trees, you can't reason with them. Crazy. There we go. Prune that up. Uh, oh, yeah, I gotta keep that free so we can see the sap. I'm gonna let that one more grow in first. Put some right there. And we'll put some in this one. Alrighty, we've got lots of charcoal. Actually, some of this we could probably stop because we don't need all of it. But. You know what else coal dust is used for? Solar panels, which is a much better option than the coal generator. Kind of, sort of. Yeah, it is. So, I, I, yeah, it's a good idea to make more coal dust, although we still need, like, electronic circuits, and generators are expensive as well. So that's a thing. Speaking of which, let's go.
go ahead and take half this charcoal, put it in there, and we'll fire it up. Fire up the generator with fire. And fiery things. Oh my gosh, look at it. Real quick. Real quick, get everything before it grows back. Get out of here. Go, go. Ah. As a reward, we can put that in there and make some more bees. Not much. That's okay. We didn't need much. Oh no, another one's grown. Ah. Ah. Creepy. All right, look at this. We got our last coal dust. This might be it, folks. We got two, six, one piece of obsidian. Here we go. You ready? You ready? You ready? You ready? You ready? Because we have to compress it. Oh snap! You thought we were ready. We're not. We're not, we're not that ready. I made a noise. That's also the wrong one. Keep macerating. I want this one. Herp -a -derp. All right. So this is going to compress. It'll come go into compressed coal balls, and then we turn the, the obsidian into chunks, and then we we'll compress that. I kind of want to compress my shovel. So let's see. We're using two machines. Um, the power levels are going up, but they're going up a little more slowly. It, it's just barely producing something. Just barely. So interesting science note here. Uh, output and 32 energy units per time. Energy units per time. Now, I've always liked to think of these as joules because joule is, for me, a joule is a very familiar unit. I'm, I'm well acquainted with the joule. I like joules, but not everyone does. And in fact, a lot of, sci well, I won't say scientists, but a lot of people prefer to think of things in terms of power. You know, you don't have 60 joule light bulbs, you have 60 watt light bulbs. And, and that can really be useful sometimes. Like your 60 watt light bulb, yeah, it takes a certain amount of energy, but you want to make sure that you have the right amount of energy you know, per unit of time to run it. Otherwise, it could take a long time to get the energy needed to run it for just a little bit of time. Because when you want your light bulb lit, you probably want it for, lit for you know, longer, you know, a longer period of time than, I don't know, a second or two. And you probably don't want to wait a long time to get that. So let's look at a 60 watt light bulb. Now a watt is an interesting unit. And it's one of the interesting units because it's actually a met uh, an SI unit, which, you know, is secretly metric. Guys, don't tell anyone, but watt is an SI unit. You've been using metric all, the, all this time and you didn't even know. That's why the um, other unit of power that most people know is the horsepower. Blah, I can't talk. This is the horsepower. Now, I don't know off the top of my head what the conversion is from horsepower to watts. I'm sure somebody does, and they will enlighten me in the description. Or comments, or whatever it is. Wherever it is that people do the enlightening. I'm sure somebody knows off the top of their head. They'll be like, oh, director, don't you know? Blah, 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 blah. And I'll be like, I don't care. Shut up. <clears throat> so, yeah, that's a thing. And... Oh. There we go. Happy birthday. So let's say so, so a 60 watt light bulb, which was the standard incandescent watt light bulb for a while. Although I don't think 60 watt light bulb is super bright. Nonetheless, a 60 watt light bulb uses 60 watts. Well, that watt is a unit of power, and power is energy per time. It can be energy used per time or energy given off per time. In the case of this generator, this generator, oops, sorry, not the generator. Uh, well, the generator and the bad box, kind of. They both give off energy per time. Now, the generator gives off energy per time based on what's in it and how fast it's burning and all that. And the bat box gives off a very constant 22 energy units per time. A watt is one joule per time. <clears throat> one joule per second. Oh, man. This is going to be cool. I've never done this before. I'm a little nervous. It's okay. Cold chunk. Ready? So, a 60 watt light bulb therefore uses 60 joules of energy every second. Oh, wait, what? 
yeah, 60 joules of energy every second. That's That seems like quite a lot, doesn't it? It seems like a lot. Not so much. Ta-da! Huzzah! We've done it, folks. I think we actually gave it a lot of extra EMC that it didn't have before. So if we needed to, I think this is a good way of doing that. Um, I'd have to look. A stack of coal might actually be that much. So it's questionable. But I think we might have given either way. We can now make diamond. Yes! Diamond has been learned. And we also have gold. So what do we need to do with this diamond? Well, you know, we need a philosopher's stone. I think that's the first thing we need. And to do that, we're going to need just a little bit of glowstone and a little bit of redstone. Uh, both of those are fuel, so that won't be a problem in getting it at all. We'll just take this charcoal, we need to take it anyways, plunk it in here, and grab some of that stuff. Oops, on spot. Alright, we're going to grab two pieces of glowstone and four pieces of redstone. This will be the first thing we make with our... That's not the recipe. I, I knew that. You're all probably like, oh my god. So embarrassing. That's the recipe. Herp -a derp Philosopher of Stone. Smelting value 124. Smelting value 64 plus. Of all this stuff apparently comes out to 124. I doubt it. I doubt it. Yeah, we got a Philosopher's Stone. We can... Philosophize! And some of you are probably like, going, why did you make that? You didn't really need it. And maybe you're right. But I don't think so. Now the one thing I'm not going to make is I'm not going to make a condenser. I will make a collector, but I will not make a condenser. I think they're too cheap. So. We've finally succeeded in making diamond, and we've learned a little bit more about the unit of power. We've also maybe hopefully made the connection that if energy units from industrial craft are equivalent to um, jewels in the real world, that the energy by the machines in industrial craft use watts, and even if not, you've hopefully learned that they uh, use measurements of power, not of energy. That's okay though, because a lot of times we want measurements of power instead of energy. Just think about it. If a watt, if, uh, yeah, 60 watts is 60 joules per second, how long would you like to leave a light bulb run? An hour? That's 3,600 seconds, which is 3,600 times 60, which is something like 10 times 6 times, uh, yeah. So, that's a thing, 36,000, I don't even know. I don't even know off the top of my head, and I'm not going to do it right now. You can do it yourself. It's just a lot of energy to run the light bulb for an hour. But really, a jewel just isn't not, a jewel is not a lot of energy. But anyways, hopefully you've learned something there. Uh, and we have a diamond, so we're going to celebrate by cutting down leaves. And our diamond has led to the creation of a philosopher's stone. Oh yeah. Now we can do things with philosophy and stuff. Now, actually, our next goal was to get a block of diamond. Haha! -ha. Good luck with that one, right? Yeah. But if we can get a block of diamond, then we can get a collector going. An energy collector. Which is like a solar panel, but for a different type of energy. And once we've got that going, then we can make energy bits, and we can throw our energy bits in here, and get more stuff. Now we could also throw, you know, wood in here. And I think, if I remember right, that stone is actually the best, because stone has um, one smelting value per EM, per each EMC. So that's pretty damn or darn, pretty darn good. Do do do. Because that means we can make lots of stone. But anyways, we'll be fine. We'll be good. We got a lot done. We have finally gotten one of our earliest goals, which was to get diamond. Um, I still, like I said, I still want a block of diamond so I can make a collector. But what else should we do after that? There's got to be more. What can we build here? Because we've got a pretty good setup. We're pretty stable. We've survived for a long time. Uh, what do we need? Uh, are we still working on getting that mass, that matter condenser for UU matter? Or do we want something else? 
What do we want? Maybe, maybe we want a, a tiny railway. Uh, a bigger monster spawner. Not that that's going to cost us much or be challenging that to build, you know. But it, it'd be something to do, and it might be interesting to see what sort of design we get. So uh, if you have any ideas for the expansion of Ponyville and Texki, how should we expand Texki? More, more Thalmcraft, maybe. More industrial craft. What do you think? Let us know. And uh, remember to, you know, like and share and stuff like that. Because that's always nice to see that. Uh, I like... I, I should stop saying plus. You know, it's really nice for me to see all those the comments and the shares and the likes. Um, I, I can't actually see the shares. But I can kind of infer that they're happening if the view counts and especially if minutes viewed goes up. Those are both measures that I use to assess how much people like my stuff. Uh, audience retention, there's another thing, so if that's a thing you were interested in, now you know more about it. And if it's not a thing you were interested in, now you know more about it anyway. So take that. I can't, I can't reach them. Do I have a sword? I don't have a sword. Uh... Alright then, until next time everypony, keep on trotting. Woohoo! Hey, diamonds, diamonds.